Well, good morning to you, too. <laughs> good morning, everybody. Had a very interesting evening. You did? Yes. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Tell everybody what you did. Kevin rolled out of bed again. Uh-huh. Yep. And hurt your hand and knee. And hurt his hand and your knee. Your hand and knee. Yeah. I don't know how I did that, but... Yeah. I don't know what's going on anymore, guys. For the last two nights, I did get a good night's sleep, except I rolled off, off the couch. I fell asleep on the couch last night, and I rolled off the couch. So, as for those of you who don't know, Val's sleeping on the couch. She's in trouble, so I sent her out on the couch. I've been sleeping on the couch because I haven't been sleeping, and I've been trying to be nice and not wake my husband up. And so he, she's keeping all the animals uh, company out here. Yes. And I was going to go sleep in on the bed tonight, but this one right here... Alvin? ...would just be sitting outside the bedroom door going... <coughs> yeah. We'd have to let all the animals come in and sleep with us. Mm-hmm. And uh, Mojo especially will, will come in and do his attacks on your stomach and run away and keep... Bootsy in a continuous state of, yeah, so. <laughs> Did I scare you? <laughs> so I'm not really sure what to do about it. So I'm going to sleep on the couch again so I can keep the animals happy. And I'm going to get a tie down and I'm going to wrap it around the couch and tie her down. I don't think I really need a tie down. I just rolled over, I guess. All right. And they all rolled over and one fell out. Alvin! Go get the door! Good morning. It is raining today. I don't know if you can see it. It just started. I've been out here in the garage for a little while already. Um, we are pretty financially strapped at this point and I've got some items in the garage that are antique that um, I can sell. So trying to sand this table down. It's a hundred year old kitchen table made of uh, pine and it was actually given to us by uh, Nikki and John and it's been sitting in here waiting to be refinished. So I started sanding. Not a good day to do this because it's rainy but I need to I need to do something right now. Um, I will sand this down, get the marks out of it and I will put a coat of wax on the top. So I'm not going to put any kind of finish on it, just wax. Uh, I also have this gurney that we had purchased a couple years back for the Halloween thing. And right now it's in the way. And so I will put that on Craigslist or eBay or something as well. Get that out of here and hopefully make a little money. I'm, asking, I'm probably going to ask about uh, 75 to 100 for each. table's worth more than that, but... Uh, you know, we have a really bad market right now. I haven't been able to get anything to sell. You know, I was putting stuff on eBay like mad and getting pennies on the dollar. So, that's why I had stopped. Not that I had run out of things to sell. Just nobody was willing to pay me anything for it besides a few pennies. So, I'm going to finish that. And there's a couple items in the house I'm probably also going to... Try to put on All right, so I did just a cursory sanding of this table, and the wax will bring out the color again. And I don't want to sand it down to uh, so it's smooth. This is a hundred-year-old table that was used in a kitchen, and it needs to look like a hundred-year-old table used in a kitchen. Okay, so I'm starting to put some wax on here. I'm just using a paste finishing wax from uh, in wax. And it's giving it a nice amber color again. I'm probably going to pull out some steel wool, which will help remove some of this old buildup, uh, and put down the wax at the same time. Okay, so there it is. It has one coat of wax on it. I'll give it some time to dry. Probably a lot longer than I would normally expect because of the weather. And it's got some character. I will buff this out and put a second coat on, and that's all I'll put on it. 
and see what I can get for it. So, babe. Yes, dear. Did you notice a lot of the comments today about uh, my comment about us moving? Yeah, it kind of surprised me. I thought people were aware of what was going on. So, basically, um, I've been trying real hard to get all this uh, home improvement done. So that's, we're about a month away to, uh, from default on our mortgage. So, um, mom's been keeping us afloat for the last several months. Not really, last couple of months because I was able to use uh, the, uh, the stocks that I sold to keep us afloat for about two and a half months. I was hoping it would last longer, but it didn't. So we're going to have to sell the house um, or lose it one or the other and uh, so that's why I'm trying so hard to get this kitchen done because uh, otherwise for you know with the market the way it is unless this house is uh, you know moving ready people are not going to be going to pay me very much pay us very much for it so that's what's going on plus uh, you noticed I we're going to start selling stuff off because we have no money and we, get, we have a couple of antiques in the front room that we're probably going to see if we can un sell. Bad time, right after Christmas. Nobody's spending money. It's also a bad time to sell a house because of the same reasoning. Hey there. Hey, your butt. Come over here. <laughs> so when I said that, um, yeah, we are actually going to be selling the house. We don't know exactly when or anything, but... Um, <laughs> It'll We've been be talking. Sooner than yeah, later. we had been talking about it for months and months, and um, at this point, Kevin has expanded his job search to other states, and uh, we got to go where the job takes us. So, yeah. Yeah, and I'm not going to work at McDonald's. Sorry, <laughs> I'd still lose the house. Yeah, we'd still lose the house, and we'd have uh, plenty of burgers. <laughs> There went my dot, my surgery out the window. Yeah, here's your <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, we'll keep you guys informed uh, as soon as we know. But you know what? We can vlog no matter where we live. So that's right. Hello. You know, I can't afford to bury you anywhere. I'm gonna have to just dig a hole in the backyard. No, can you just light me on fire somewhere? Light you on fire? Yeah, I want to be cremated. <laughs> okay. <laughs> got a barbecue in the back. All right. <laughs> you got to cut me up in a little plate pieces to fit me on the barbecue first. <laughs> okay. I'm going to drag you in the bathtub then. <laughs> I think we still have that hook hanging in there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Beating up the camera now. I'm up. Okay. Say goodbye. Good night. <laughs> well, everybody. <laughs> She's alive. I'm alive. She's alive. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, guys. I'm alive. I think we're squishing a little dog between us here. <laughs> you okay there, buddy? Where are you? Right don't even see. Oh. Right there. Right there. See? See, his little face. <laughs> right. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed hanging out with us today. And it was wet. And it was damp. Yeah, it was and wet and it, and it was it, damp. And it was dark. And it was dark. And Kevin did some work on a table, an antique table. Yep. That Nikki and John gave us. Yeah. And I did some work. I cleaned the bedroom today. We didn't film that though. No, but I did it. Yes, she did. Mm hmm Can't see you. There you are. Hi. Oh. Ah! That's better. <laughs> so. Anyway, if you enjoyed hanging out with us today, please give us a great big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please press that little red subscribe button down below and join the neighborhood community. Because we have an awesome community of awesome people and awesome animals. We're all <laughs> sitting on us right now. Right? 
<laughs> well, they were sitting on us. First. There's Mojo over there somewhere. Anyway, and share this video with your family and friends. And we, us, here, the two of us, mm -hmm, us, we, will see you, all of you guys, every single one of you out there watching us, we'll see you tomorrow.